the life of a mega nerd, baby. We doing things and we making it happen, right? From the trash 80 to a black Mercedes, no one can stop us now, cause we're keeping it nerdy, nice. What's up, YouTube? This is Chris with Sage Films, and uh, before we get on with the tutorial, I just want to point out a couple things to you guys. Uh, number one, uh, please subscribe to the backup channel. I cannot stress that enough. Uh, it takes about two seconds. Just click on the link to the right and just click subscribe. It's all it takes because I'm pretty close to getting banned on this account if I get one more copyright issue on me, and I do not want that to happen. And if it does, I want to make sure that I have all my subscribers with me when I continue with the tutorial version. Anyway, uh, another thing, number two, uh, as you've probably seen in this video, uh, my intro is back to the basic intro, solely because my channel has been based on black, gray, and red. Three basic colors I've based everything around, and uh, like, I'll, I'll to make this change from uh, like intros, I'd have to change my background on my computer, my background on my channel, and I really don't want to do that, so I'm just going to stick to the basic stuff of stuff that I could. But besides all this, let's just go ahead and get started with the tutorial. So just go ahead and go file, new, and make this whatever you want. I make mine 1000 by 200 solely because it makes it a good banner. That's a good dimension for a banner. Make sure your background is transparent. Okay, now just go ahead and grab your text tool. And just make any text you want. I'm gonna make what modern Warfare 2 for the second tutorial. I don't want to work out too. Okay, now what we're gonna do is we're gonna highlight all of our text and go over here to the text color and go to this little uh, number field underneath all these other fields. And enter E E F F E. So that'll give us a good kind of off green, off white kind of color. So there we go, we got that. Uh, I just move this to wherever you want. And you can go down here to the right of where it says of your text layer here, my one for two, and double click. And then you're gonna get your layer style here, move this off to the side, and just click outer glow, and uh, just change the color. Now, uh, for this, you'll do the same thing as the numeric, uh, the number field down there. It's our 7D FF60. And that will give us our glow effect around our page. So there we go, we got this. Now you can just edit this wherever you want. Uh, size, doesn't really matter. That there, looks good to me. Just click on that. Okay, now what we're gonna do, we're gonna file, new, make this one pixel by three pixels. This is gonna be small for one reason, you'll see why. <coughs> Excuse me. Alright, so go ahead and go to this window. Make sure your zoom level is at 2000%. And I go up here to your pencil tool. If you do not have the pencil tool selected, I click and hold in, it's on the brush tool, just click pencil. Just make a little black mark, make sure both of these are black. Just make a little black mark right in the middle. There we go. Alright, then go to edit, find pattern, and this is where you're going to save your pattern. I want to save mine as modern warfare 2 text. There we go. Just click OK. Alright, make sure you click on this window now. Go to file, layer, no don't go to file, go to layer, new, layer, layer 1, and uh, now what we're going to do is we're going to go to, on this layer 1, grab your uh, stamp tool, click it in, hold it, and get pattern stamp tool. Click here and select your pattern, which is this one we created, the Modern Warfare 2 text. Just click off of here. And just basically just make this all around it, you know. It doesn't have to be perfect. Just make that like that. Doesn't matter. Alright, now, what we're gonna do is make sure your model for piece text layer is selected. And go to, uh, layer, new, background somewhere. And there we go. We've got a model for two text. Now it looks pretty professional. It looks exactly like it is on the case. Uh, also, the text we use is Bank Gothic, so I'm going to have a download link in the tutorial for that, uh, in the description sidebar. So I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. Uh, please rate, comment, and subscribe. The link for my backup channel will be in the sidebar, along with the download for the font. I uh, hope you guys enjoy this. Please rate, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time.